Right, hello, we've got here a new parcel delivered from eBay. Let's see what we've got in here. So it's very neatly packed. I really appreciate this. Not too much of a wrapping, just what is really required. Um, certainly reduces the carbon footprint. Um, easy to open. Let's see what's inside. Oh, I can see something in bubble wrap. So here we've got something in a lot of bubble wrap and a few of these um, uh, chips which um, you can throw in water and they collapse and you can flush them down the toilet because they're 100% natural products. Let's take the box out and let's see what's in here. A few bubbles. That's fun. The hours of this. So oh. one and another one. Let's open it all up. That seems to be a well, at least a box is an Engo Engo um, locomotive. Quite neatly packed still, the box is in a great condition. Some paperwork here. Let's see, white pieces of paper. Probably just to protect the engine really. And a little train. Ah, see? Ah, uh, beautiful. That's, that's it really. Let's take it out of the styrofoam box. It's quite heavy, nice little machine. Some parts are missing of this tram. Um, oh, it's even a wheel is missing here. That's that's annoying. Um, so this clearly needs to be fixed at some point. Uh, the axe is broken here. That's not a great purchase then. So. But still, let's see where the engine is actually running. Let's put it in here. Well, it certainly will not be able to go around the track. I'd assume being on seven wheels only, but let's see what's happening if I power it up. There seems to be some power in the machine. That's not bad. It just doesn't seem to So something is happening, um, but of course with missing wheels it's always a bit difficult. Maybe let's turn it the other way around, zoom in and see what happens if I go straight with the power onto the wheels. Um, first so the motor seems to be working but the wheels don't spin brilliant so let's see how we can fix these engines this uh, nice little train I keep you posted thanks for watching